Well, you can see it's the day after Halloween and it's raining. It's raining pretty good. It's kind of coming down. It was actually raining last night, but um, I don't know. I'm about to go toy hunting. You go. I'm about to do some body shots. What? Turn up. Man here doing a video. I'm um, going toy hunting right now. It's the day after Halloween. <laughs> My son in the background. It's uh, it's uh, yeah, it's the day after Halloween. We're 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 gonna go toy hunting and see what's what's new, what's out. Cause usually in my area, the Toys R Us and Targets and all that. They well, Targets usually get a lot of new stuff anyways, almost daily, I guess. But it just depends. Um, Toys R Us though, they do get uh, they do get a truck in on Saturdays and on Sundays as well and I think I think Thursdays and Saturdays but um so today's Saturday the day after Halloween and we're definitely gonna go ahead and do some do some toy hunting and it is it is raining it's raining out it's actually raining pretty good I didn't expect I wasn't expecting it to actually rain uh, today or at least not this early and not this heavy but um, anyways how was your guys's Halloween let me know in the comments below what you guys did this, I think this is gonna be like my first toy hunting video I guess you can say because I've done I've made several attempts to do other videos but they never actually I never actually got to got to get them like edited and and put them out so this is my first one that you guys are gonna be seeing uh, I think we're just gonna be going to a couple stores I'm probably gonna to go to Walmart to look for a few um, blu-rays so we'll see we'll see how all this goes but um just join me for the ride Exiting finally. I mean, we hit we hit a bit of uh, of traffic due to due to the rain. Um, it, it normally, normally doesn't take me that long to get to this Toys R Us, but because it was raining, it took uh, quite a while for us to get here, <clears throat> just because of the traffic and you know obviously people are having more cautious. But you do go you do get those people that still speed on the freeway. But uh, yeah, I mean this is a nice little area where this Toys R Us is located. And um, it's it's pretty cool. There's a lot of just a lot of hills. You can see the mountains and everything around here. But I'll show you guys a, a shot of the view of how it looks like here in a second. Shopping center right there on your left. But I'll get to that in a second. So you can see the hills and mountains and all that right there, straight ahead. Um, you guys can see all that right there. <clears throat> it's pretty nice. And then over here is the shopping center on the left hand side. So you can see there is, I don't even know if, how close this camera is going to pick it up, but there's a Target, there's a Kohl's, there's a theater, which I come here every once in a while. I do like the theater here. It doesn't really get that packed in this area. Um, this Romero's. I do come to this Target sometimes, uh, but you can see it's pretty cloudy. It's wet around the floors. Chick-fil-A. Love Chick-fil-A. And then right over here, there it is, Toys R Us and Babies R Us. It's a fairly big... Toys R Us. There's a Bevmo over there on your left if you guys want to get a drink. But there, there you go. Toys R Us. Oh yeah. That's what we've been waiting for. Let's go ahead and step out. So I'm in the turtle aisle. We have the classics here. These ones have comic books on them. These ones are a little different. So these are single carded ones. And then these are comic ones, but they're the same figures. But it doesn't look like there's <clears throat> it doesn't look like there's anything new as far as the turtles go. But they got a whole section here. Here's the uh, like NECA aisle. It's kind of empty right now. There's that Friday of the Thirteenth. Magic. The reaction toys. <clears throat> Some wrestling figures. It's 
kind of empty though. Nothing really good. It's Transformers. For all the Transform, no Jacob. Waterboard section. Those skateboards are pretty cool. Nothing in the six inch figure black series. Nothing new at least. Man, these guys, these got stocked up. Legends, same old stuff. There's nothing really, there's nothing really good that's out right now. Just a bunch of the same old stuff that you see everywhere else. Marvel, everything is just the same. These are actually starting to become really cool. I really didn't think these were gonna like go off and now they're making so many figures. There's Deadpool, looks pretty nice. They even have Transformer ones, Ghost Rider, Classic Wolverine, Hulk, Venom. Oh, no, we're good. Thank you. Here's all these video game um, focus figures that are coming out, which are pretty cool. Look at that track set right here. It's pretty cool. But there's a lot of video game stuff out now. Power Ranger stuff's pretty weak. I don't see anything as far as like the legacies, the legacies go. There's nothing really good that's out. Everything pretty much is just the same old, same old stuff. These have those big turtle uh, Michelangelo figures, but I haven't seen those anymore. I think I've only seen them one time and now they're gone. Inside Toys R Us, the different one that I went to. Drax. I already have these. I'm just showing you guys what they have, like Drax, and there's a Nova. So they had, they actually had a full set of um, Legends, and this is actually pretty new. Even though they released this, I guess it's like a single-carded Pacific Rim figure. It's a box version, so it's pretty crazy of um, Knifehead. I don't, I don't even know how many versions of this we've gotten already. I didn't even know they were going to release a box version of this, but. There's nothing really new here. Everything it's pretty much the same as the other Toys R Us. They got the bigger versions of the scalpers or scalpers of the scalers. Godzilla, Rambo. Nothing too good. Toys R Us was uh, kind of a. Uh, a failure here. There wasn't really anything there. I got some stuff from my son because he's really into Sonic right now. So I got him some Sonic. Um, let me see if I can get him right here. Some Sonic uh, figures. So <coughs> excuse me. So you can see there's this here: Sonic and Amy Rhodes, and Knuckles and Tails. He loves. He he was really into Sonic right now. So these are pretty cool. And um, I ended up getting something for me but it's just to have extra because I, I actually opened one of these and I want to keep another one sealed they have tons of these um, Ghostbusters Ecto ones they had tons of them like like eight of them or nine of them so but other than that this Toys R Us didn't really have much there wasn't really much going on so what I'm gonna do now targets right across the way I'm pretty sure they're not gonna have anything the other target I went to that's closer to the house that's where I found like a bunch of the um the speeder bike and uh, the the shadow squadron um the target exclusive the the rock flashback figure which i think i have in here is sitting right over there the rock flashback figure and um the marvel legends um three pack but we're gonna hit target up and see what's up so i'll see if i can bring you guys along the ride so here we are here we are <laughs> outside of target and we're gonna see exactly what this store is gonna have inside this one right woman cat Nothing good at Target. There's Venom again. Target exclusives. Rock. So they still have these. 50 bucks, man. So expensive. 
These are okay, still so I'm out of target. There was nothing really to shoot in there. There's nothing really to pick up. I mean, I was looking at the Blu-rays, and for all you guys who watch my videos, subscribe to me. You guys know I have a lot of Blu-rays, but I almost have like a lot of the stuff I need in there. But there wasn't a lot of there wasn't a lot of figures. They didn't have anything new. Um, I mean, they did have the um, Star Wars, you know, the the Target exclusive and the uh, Marvel Legends exclusive. So you guys saw, but nothing in Target. We might go to Walmart. The sun is finally out. You can see through the sunroof here. The sun is finally out. I'm actually going to be heading to Vitamin Vitamin Shop. I think that's the name of the place. Vitamin Shop. I am going to pick up a pre-workout drink, which is um, come on guys, which is uh, for pre-workout. <laughs> so I'm going to be picking up a pre-workout drink, which is C4. If all you guys, you know, for all you guys who work out and you guys take a pre-workout drink. Definitely check out C4 by Cellucor. Um, I've tried a lot of the pre-workout drinks. I've tried a lot. I've tried um, BSN's NO Explode. I've tried uh, VPX's Shotgun. Um, I've tried Redline, holy moly. You know, I've tried, of course, the regular energy drinks, uh, Rockstar, Red Bull, Monster, which I'm addicted to right now. But I would say, I don't even know if this is open. I would say uh, C4 is probably the best one that I've came across so far. BSNs, I know explodes really strong, but C4 is I something I really like. But I'm gonna head over here right now and get me some C4. Out of uh, Vitamin Shop, and I just got my pre-workout drink. It's starting to get, woo, losing the camera. It's starting to get hot now, um, but this is the stuff that I picked up, and that's C4. I got the fruit punch flavor. This one has 30 servings, but um, well, let me show you guys again in case you guys wanna see it. So it's C4 by Cellucor. Definitely recommend you guys check it out if you guys do work out and are looking for a really good pre-workout drink. And it tastes pretty good. It, it does taste pretty good. Oh, you know what's another one I did try, which I did like was um, Optimum's Nutrition's uh, Pre, Optimum Pre, or Platinum Pre. That was another good one too, but I honestly like C4 a lot better. But um, I don't know what I'm gonna do now. I didn't really find much today. I uh, wasn't gonna go to Frankincense, but because it was raining, I didn't really feel like driving that far out, so. I don't know where I'm gonna be heading out now. Possibly, maybe Walmart, but I don't know. Walmart hasn't been really showing a lot of stuff, like selling a lot of good stuff lately, but um, I don't know, we'll see. If not, then this might be the end of the video. Uh, but make sure you guys watch my other videos. Subscribe if you guys haven't subscribed. Like my videos, share my videos. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for coming along this trip. Um, there wasn't really a lot to shoot, and plus it was raining, so. I didn't I couldn't really shoot while I was driving and I couldn't shoot like walking to the car and walking back and all that because of you know it was raining but uh, my son's running around back there playing with his um, sonic toys but yeah so if you guys want to see more videos like this let me know in the comments below um, on a better day where it's like sunny and uh, we can I can shoot a lot more and again because of the traffic and everything I did not there's a lot more Toys R Us and targets in my area but traffic was pretty bad and the rain was pretty heavy so that's the whole reason why I didn't shoot other ones. But the storm clouds are still out, so I'm pretty sure it's going to start to rain again. But thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe. Like my videos. Hope you guys had a happy Halloween. See you guys later. Take care.